Mac and cheese is a delicious comfort food, but it's often loaded in calories, fat, and sodium. So today I'm here with Chef Lee Gross of M Cafe, who's going to show us a healthy alternative. Here's what you need for the sauce. Half of a pound of mozzarella soy cheese, one and a half ounces of nutritional yeast, one cup of organic unsweetened soy milk, one teaspoon of sea salt, black pepper to taste, two cloves of garlic smashed, two springs of thyme, and one bay leaf. For the pasta, four ounces of gluten-free fusilli pasta, two tablespoons of sun-dried tomatoes, three asparagus spears sliced, a fourth of a cup of baby arugula, one teaspoon of extra virgin olive oil, three fluid ounces of the mac and cheese sauce, sea salt and black pepper to taste. So let's get started. All right, let's make the sauce. We're gonna take um, soy mozzarella cheese. Perfect. Right into a pot. And it smells up really nice. Right. Vegan, casein and free. Yeah, and this is a great alternative, obviously, to real cheese. Right. Not the same amount of fat. Mm -hmm. and calories. Plant-based. Yeah. And soy milk. Love it. Okay, so we're adding nutritional yeast. This is another ingredient that goes into the sauce. It gives it vitamin B12, yes. uh, depth of flavor, sort of a cheesiness. Exactly, and it's so full of protein and essential amino acids. And I love to use nutritional yeast just like I would Parmesan cheese. Exactly. Yeah. What we're going to do is we're going to season it with a little bit of salt, sea salt, and freshly grated black pepper. Perfect. And we're going to infuse some flavor into it. We're going to take some fresh thyme, a bay leaf, pull over to a garlic, and just to release the flavor, we're just going to smash it. Put it right in there. Bring this up to the heat mm -hmm. and just whisk until it's creamy, melted, and love delicious. It. And you can pick out the herbs. And I love the thyme. It really gives a depth of flavor. I and love it's not thyme. something I'd usually think about when I think mac and cheese. Right. That's well, cool. One of my favorite herbs. Love it. So that's our sauce. Perfect. And then once it's cooked and nice and creamy, we're gonna heat our brown rice fusilli and we're gonna add the sauce, toss it through along delicious. with some fresh blanched asparagus tips today. We're using some wild arugula for a pepperiness. And get your greens in. Cut some of that Good. richness. And we have sun-dried tomatoes as well. Oh, that's delicious. You can mix cheese. it. Yeah, it yeah. is. You can mix it whatever you want. Butternut squash would be great in the season. Shiitake mushroom. Anything you want. Uh, and that, that's it. It's very simple. All right. So we've made the cheese sauce. We've integrated all the components, and now we're ready for the taste test. All right. All right. Let's do it. I can't wait. This looks so delicious. Mmm. Mm. Yeah, it tastes man. just like mac and cheese. It's delicious. It's delicious. Absolutely delicious. I. Can't even stop. Creamy. This is like the ultimate comfort food. Thank you so much. You're very welcome. We'll see you next time on Pop Sugar Fitness.